it's daily challenge time! So, uh, you're hearing this in post-production when I'm editing the video, but it's because when I was recording in Streamlabs, um, I had my speakers and my microphone muted for some reason. Don't know why I did that, but it's, uh, it happened. But anyways, uh, daily challenge May 5th. And uh, the first location here, I'm just having a quick look around. I noticed a little bit of Spanish on the house there. And um, I was a bit confused at first uh, because I couldn't really find any good clues. But then I went down the road here. And as you'll see in a bit, there's a Coca-Cola sign. Uh, that's pretty big in um, South America. Um, being that Amer the United States has really put an effort to spread you know, US capitalism and um, Coca-Cola and that sort of thing all over South America. But then I see Concepcion, which is a town in the southern part of Chile. I kind of um and are a little bit about um, where it could be, but I couldn't really find the other locations, Tirua and Contulmo, but that's all good. A um, little bit of moving around on the map, but I go, okay, I'll just guess on Concepcion. And it was a little bit further to the south, but that's all good. Uh, second location here, uh, pretty iconic, kind of uh, Cyrillic with the uh, orange, like bricked or shingled roofs that you see everywhere. Um, I was thinking maybe Romania, um, but because I saw that O with the vertical dash through it, I was thinking, okay, it's probably Bulgaria. And then I see the taxi that didn't really help too much, but um, I end up just deciding, okay, yeah, it's probably just going to be Bulgaria, somewhere residential, but also um, like an industrial area. Then I just kind of go, yeah, it'll be somewhere in the middle, if not the eastern part of Bulgaria. It was North Macedonia, but it was still in the general region. Third location here, um, I was thinking it might have been like South America somewhere, but then we see Hyundai, and that's pretty big in um, South Korea. Then I move over to this um, road sign, or the highway sign, and I see that it's got the um, Korean script there. <clears throat> it's a pretty hard country to region guess in. Um, I kind of um and are a little bit more. I was thinking, could it be somewhere near... Um, this, like, this city here kind of looks the same, similar kind of spelling. And then uh, I click on Se Sejong, but it was the island to the south of South Korea, which was, that's a really tricky location in itself. Then fourth location, pretty easy, um, gonna be Australia. I see the timber pole there as I point out. And then I look on the, the bollards there and you see the short markers. Now that's mainly found in SA and Queensland. So I go just kind of somewhere near Brisbane. Um, and it was, it was, I think it was like 40 Ks away. So I was a really good, really good guess there. And then I zoom in on this car and it says San Juan. So I was thinking, okay, another South America or Mexico. And if you see the Corona beers advertised anywhere, then you're going to be in Mexico because that's probably like their national um, drink. Um, I was thinking if it was going to be somewhere towards Mexico City. Um, I go a little bit north of it, a bit northwest, I guess. And yeah, it was just uh, slightly south, 21.6k, not too bad. And then here I'm probably just saying. Uh, if you want to see more uh, GeoGuessr content, uh, make sure to subscribe and then also follow me on Twitch. I've got a Discord set up now. I'm close to hitting affiliate. And uh, if you guys want to see more, definitely stick around. I'll be playing a lot more GeoGuessr and I'll see you guys later.